So yeah, uh, once upon a time I was uh, I was just walking around a very small village in the middle of nowhere in South India. I don't know the name of the village. I don't know anything about anything. And there was this huge festival. Like it's it's you know India is like full of festivals. It happens all the time. Whenever you you're uh, you're there, you will find like you know festivals all the time they love dancing they love music they love colors and it's it's just amazing okay and i'm just there this is maybe the first hour for me i'm uh, there and i i have this huge backpack on, on my back i have another uh, another backpack in on my stomach and sunglasses and just uh, and it's really hot and i'm boring and i don't know what i'm doing i don't know what i'm uh, i don't know where to go i don't know anything and out of nowhere, uh, there's uh, this guy who sells, uh, uh, who makes and sells drums. Like literally, he he gets, uh, I think I think you know some kind of leather, and he makes drums. And he was like playing his drums like crazy, and it was really beautiful. I I love drums, you know. So I I don't know. Somebody was with me. One of my friends. And she liked the drums too, so we thought, you know what, let's go and check them out. We will not be able to buy them because they're very big and we can't actually take them. We're backpackers, but you know, it sounds fun and I want. she wanted to try them and I wanted to listen to drums and stuff like that. So I thought, you know what, let's go and check them out. And you know, the first, the first thing he says to us was, Are you pregnant? What is your profession? Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Jordan. I'm from Jordan and you are watching the Jordan show. Today we are reacting to a video uh, from Michael McNulter. I don't know how to say his last name. You guys tell me how to pronounce it down in the comments down below. And the video is on accents. Uh, that was this video was suggested by one of you guys on the discord server So please if you want me uh, to react to something very specific or whatever, you know go to the discord server and uh, You know, you know browse to the uh, Videos to react to channel and put your link there. I love you guys very much. And yeah, let's start the video Roll it! <laughs> I try to speak in the accent. Do you know what I mean? Irish. I'm not very good at this accent. <laughs> but the Irish accent, it seems quite jolly, doesn't it? Hello! How are you? It's jolly! <laughs> as long as you're smiling. <laughs> oh my god. I love Irish accent. It's I think it's one of my favorite accents ever. I, I, I just love listening to it, you know, all the time. You know, like when I meet any Irish people, I was like, you know, please soak. You know, I, I just want to have fun and Enjoy myself, you know. Come on, speak. Come on, come on, speak. Speak to me. Smiling, you can do a pretty good Irish accent. <laughs> but Northern Irish, these are right next door to them. Suddenly, everything in the whole world seem incredibly depressing to me. Right? <laughs> Open your face to the completely opposite to that. I'm over here. But I'm next door to you, and I decided that I'm not. I don't understand how these accents can evolve like that. Some evolution of accents, I understand. Like when you go west in England, when you when you head west, you'll hit like Bristol, and they've got this like west country like that. They'll start talking like that. We're in Bristol now. We're a little bit busy, so we speak basically with this accent, but it's quite fast because we're like a sea. We've got like things to do. We've like, got businesses and that, right? <laughs> Oh my god, this is awesome. We've got like a city center. <laughs> then you go to Devon, you keep going west, you go to Devon, and it's the same accent, but it's a bit slower now, all right? <laughs> they don't have quite as much going on here as they do in the city of Bristol. We're in Devon now, so we're just going to speak in the same accent, but we'll just take our time with that, because we've got more time, right? <laughs> Because we got more time, and now, oh my God, I don't know, I don't, 
think I would ever be able to actually learn how to speak in an English land, in an English accent, like for example the London accent. Maybe I should try. That would be a really cool challenge to speak in an English accent for a whole video at least. I don't know. Maybe I'll try to do that someday. By the time you get to Cornwall, it's just. <laughs> 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 as long as you make sure that every syllable that you say has nothing to do with the syllable that comes directly before. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, this reminds me. Uh, I might even go to South Africa too, so I don't know. I'm still like, you know, thinking about where should I go. It's like, that's the cool thing about my way of traveling. I don't plan anything. I just say, you know what, I'm, I'm leaving on the 15th of September. The 15th of September, you'll find me somewhere else. I don't know where. I have no idea where. I usually try what to get the cheapest flight out of here to a country I don't need a visa to. So, yeah, let's see what's gonna happen. For the one you've just said, you're pretty much doing a set if it can exit. <laughs> Australia is quite fun, okay? It's a lot of Australians living over here in London, they're pretty, you know, they, they talk quite fast as well, they're pretty hyper, yeah? The, the real Australian accent, I cannot understand at all, seriously. Like, I met so many Australians, and I met some Australian girls in, in Goa, India, and I literally couldn't understand anything from what they were saying. It was really weird. Like, I, I think I understand general, like, Australian accent, but their accent was really different. I don't know where they were from. Because they've come a long way, you know? They're going to make the most of it. It's like, you know, it took me a day. I lost a day of my life to be here. So I'm going to find out where the decibel level is in the room. And we're going to go slightly above that, OK? We're going to fly it over here in London. So when I went to Australia touring, I thought it was going to be full of people doing this. <laughs> the no. people who haven't left Australia are the most relaxed people I think I've ever come across. <laughs> they literally... <laughs> this is so fucking true. ...truly have all the time in the world to finish sentences. I mean, with 13 hours ahead, you're never going to catch up anyway. <laughs> You can't go all the way over to Australia. When you go to Australia, you have to stop off. The plane can't even go that far. That's how far away it is. So when I was touring, they said to me, where do you want to go on the way for a stop off? And they gave me these options. And I went to Singapore. I've never been to Singapore. And I went to Singapore and they said, best to stay there for a few days and acclimatise because the time difference is like... So yeah, that was really awesome. You know, whenever uh, act, the accent uh, talk happens, like, I really, like, wonder what my accent sounds like. I don't know if it sounds like I'm an Arab guy speaking English. I think it's, it's not. I think it's, the, the, the reason I have a really uh, heavy accent somehow is because I learned Japanese too. You know, that, that's the problem. Oh, it's not a problem, that's why I got this weird accent because some t so many times I, I call my, I call myself uh, speaking English in a Japanese way or speaking Arabic in an English way or speaking Japanese in a you know like Arabic way it's really crazy you know uh, and all the grammars in my brain is like like the crazy thing that I tried to learn Spanish and it was so re like so fucking hard I couldn't do that but I think it's something I want to try and do before I die. I want to actually get Spanish as my fourth language. Yeah. Anywho, uh, I hope you guys like this video. I love you guys very much. And uh, if you are new here, please consider subscribing. Uh, and you know, if you like the video, hit that like button. If you don't like it, that dislike button is for you. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. I'm business guy Jordan, you know, hence the glasses, the hat, and the formal kind of sitting. 
Now nah, I'm just fucking with you guys. So I'm the business guy Jordan. Uh, I'm here to tell you, please guys support this channel. Let's keep it alive. You know, there's the stream that link in the description down below. There's the Patreon thingy. Go ahead and support this channel. Let's keep doing the good work. That's it. No, it's not that. Mm. It was not that professional, right? I know. I'm, I'm business guy Jordan. See you guys in the next one. That's my best friend.